I mean, we have the opportunity now to share ideas with people from the, whole, the other side of the world. And those ideas can include, what did you do when your aquifer got polluted from fracking? It can, it can include, how are you dealing with these extreme weather events that are preventing food from being grown in your local area? As, the, as, as, things, as climate change heats up the world, and as people feel the impacts, we now have new ways of sharing ideas for what to do and getting to know each other, both globally and in our local area, to develop common ways of dealing with it. When you think about global climate change, especially when you think about climate justice and how those most affected are those with the least power to do anything about it, or when you think about peak oil or peak water or any of these very serious global environmental issues and local environmental issues that we face, it can seem daunting and discouraging. And um, I think that's true from one point of view, but there is another point of view where if you look at it from the perspective that we, we have more ability to work together now than ever before, people do often now in this decade share ideas across the world and interact with people that they will never meet face to face, but with whom they can brainstorm about problems and try to figure out solutions. Well, I think that that actually is a point of real optimism. I think that young people especially open the doors to that kind of global sharing and global communication. And also to local level um, through, you know, Facebook and Twitter and texting. People, people in, in a city have a, an unprecedented ability to work together and know each other, from flash mobs, you know, to these spontaneous parties. You can organize a demonstration now, as, as the Arab Spring proved. If you have a bunch of people with cell phones, you can get them there in half an hour. I mean, this is incredible. It's, it's, a, it's a wonderful oppor organizing opportunity. And so I think that we, we face daunting challenges, but we have a lot of tools at our disposal to work together to solve those challenges.